Hey folks, this is Ken from Silly Westies. I'm wrapping up my series on uh, building a uh, industry, uh, a trackside industry. Uh, if you remember, I'm using the uh, How to Build Realistic Layouts. An article uh, uh, came out uh, probably in 2007. They had them for several years. Uh, and of course, I'm building this from Paul Dolkos. as How to Model a Bulk. Uh, propane plant and uh, I did a little my own version and uh, of course remember I was using the Walters Cornerstone propane tanks as the base uh, I did some scratch building um, also I decided uh, not to wait until the chain link fences uh, I'm going to chain link fence it on at least uh, two sides uh, the building is uh, going to be the prop uh, for the uh, one side next to the highway. It's a very close scene, so the tank itself is very close. Um, also, uh, given it uh, region, uh, it's called Carolina Gas. Um, I could have used some other decals, but I did use the decal sheet, and I cut out and was able to use the, uh, the letters. Uh, right out of the decal sheet from the uh, the kit. Um, anyways, let's uh, give you a closer up look before we set it out there on the layout, and we'll see how the tank cars are going to be and where it's going to be placed, and go from there. Okay. Okay. Well, all right. Remember from the last time we had the uh, customized. Uh, uh, walk ramp and ladder. Uh, I used the um, uh, Tishy Tang Train Group details uh, kit, and so uh, I've even used that for a scratch built a uh, a platform. It's a working platform. Also, I did from the article I modified the uh, the air hose and the and the gas lines, and well. That didn't really work out too well. Um, also got the pump house and also the uh, uh, the uh, loading uh, uh, shed. Did some little light weathering on them. I've also did uh, some of the, the brick uh, or the block, excuse me. I used uh, a little bit of, um, it's, a, it's a mortar, uh, mortar, uh, almost like plaster can't remember anyway so there's some warping on here but once it's glued down it'll uh, it'll settle down on uh, each of these roofs tops here I've used uh, builders and scale scene roof uh, some of the details you'll notice this is the Walters uh, roof jack here it's an exhaust um, some of the, the uh, roll-up doors and the platform here and the uh, rails here, handrails, are from Pike Stuff. Um, the gas tanks, uh, of course, are from the kit. Um, I really, I wanted to uh, get some uh, horizontal tanks. This is a resin uh, drink machine, uh, Dr. Pepper drink machine. We love our Dr. Pepper down here in the south. I also have got the... Um, the power cord there with a conduit box so uh, you can see that also to give a, a time period and I did this on the computer I made a sign it says uh, Carolina gas dependable safe propane gas serving the southeast since 1930 so it gives some time uh, timeline there the tank is very close to the building uh, once it spreads out here it'll it'll pull away a little bit more um, also got an exhaust fan there so uh, I also did uh, all the airlines I didn't really spend a whole lot of money on that so I used uh, some craft paints and then dull coated the um, the lines I had a hard time installing those everything's very delicate once it gets onto the module I think it'll It'll settle down. Let's uh, go ahead and see what it's going to look like on the on the module now, okay? Of course, you can see the silly Westies in the background there. Okay. And again, it's it's 
I'm using a couple of spikes here to help hold it down and uh, again it's just for test fitting purposes uh, so once it gets uh, gets in place and it uh, won't be all bowed up okay so uh, it looks a little bowed up right there for right now also I did a little uh, uh, mini metals truck took it apart and painted it also did the Carolina gas on that a little bit a few tanks on there uh, dull coat that and uh, put that right there that'll uh, give some delivery of course modeling 1950s gas was kind of on the rise also I've fit the uh, the platform for uh, any well, mostly the the Atlas tank cars but uh, uh, got the the uh, safety ladders and the safety chains there um, but uh, anyway it's a pretty cool scene uh, also got clearance right there uh, probably gonna only load one tank car at a time that's about the clearance right there so we got plenty of clearance on the trucks very close okay so uh, anyway I was glad that I uh, could have you be a part of this uh, little uh, construction of uh, a scratch building kit bashing a little combination of uh, of everything uh, if you got any questions please feel free to ask always like a thumbs up um, hoping to post these soon uh, on YouTube so I can share it with uh, modeler man Mike want to give him a thumbs up and all the other guys Ben Earp uh, is just down the mountain from me not too far I live in North Carolina also so uh, anyway thanks guys for your uh, uh, your uh, support hopefully I'll get 500 people on my list and uh, then I can be a part of the uh, the panel too this is Ken from Silly West to say and I do